A hero's farewell for a Navy SEAL killed earlier this month during a battle in Iraq. Charles Keating IV was buried today with full honors at Fort Rosecrans. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live. And Steve, there were many tears shed today. Certainly were, Kim. The memorial service here at Sacred Heart Catholic Church focused on the bravery of Charlie Keating, his devotion to duty to his fellow SEALs, and his love of his family. C4 did have a sentimental human side as well. A priest told mourners that Charlie Keating was a man for others, that C4, as he called Charles Keating IV, lost his life in Iraq in a battle of biblical proportions. Good against evil, a young David against a fearsome Goliath. Without thought of self-preservation, C4 climbed to an exposed rooftop. He took the most dangerous position for himself, shielding his teammates out of harm's way. Finally, a sniper's bullet pierced his neck and the hero's lifeblood drained on behalf of all his brothers. He recalled that Charlie deeply loved his family and friends, that just before he left on his final deployment, he sought out his godmother, Auntie Beth. And he told her, I quote, I could never leave without saying goodbye to you. As Beth would later put it, that was so Charlie. It didn't matter what he had on his plate. It was all about loving the heck out of you. In the end, it was all about sacrifice and commitment. He joins the long line of American heroes who have given the last full measure of devotion. This picture is of Charlie as a boy being held by Mother Teresa, who will become a Catholic saint this year. Were many prayers, one mentioning the man who inspired Charlie, his grandfather. For Charles Keating IV, that he may be reunited in heaven with his papa, Charles Keating Jr., who inspired his service and bravery as a Navy SEAL. And that bravery and service earned him a silver star. Live in Coronado, Steve Fiorina, 10 News.